Hey guys, Dandy Dan here, just trying to show you how I've been farming with my Town Hall 11. Um, I just did a raid, and the reason I did this raid is because I'm trying to double up on a loot bonus, and basically with the new army queue, um, you know, you can train quite a few troops at a time. Let's see if I get those out of the way and train up another army. So, you know, I can train... 480 troops and full spells. Um, the only problem is, unless you want to spend gems, you don't get two sets of heroes. So, you know, most times at Town Hall 11, you kind of need the heroes to help get it done. Um, you know, so um, what I did here on this last raid is I found a base that was a Town Hall 10. Whoops, I don't want to share it. I want to replay it. Um... So it's a pretty easy base to take out, right? So, um, you know, I just go in with no heroes on this. Um, you know, kind of see what kind of damage I can do. And I see I'm going to miss the town hall. So I bring in the heroes with the warden and, you know, use his ability strictly so they don't get damaged. And as soon as that town hall's down, you know, there was no loot at this base anyway. So I just get out, take my loot bonus, and I'm done. Not even really pushing, just farming for that loot bonus. Um, and now I will go ahead and try and find another raid because I got my clan castle filled again. And I still have heroes. Um, so, you know, I can go full on with this one if I want and let my army cook again. But basically, if I get two wins, I get two loot bonuses. And then obviously on the one where I'm going full out, I'm going to look for better loot, but on the one where I'm looking for just the loot bonus, I'm just looking for an easy base to take out so I can collect that loot bonus, be it a 50% or a town hall takeout, two star, whatever I can get out of that, that's what I'm going to go for. Um, now, finding loot lately has been a little tougher at this level, uh, mainly because people are spending it on their upgrades, um, so we'll see. Getting a few clouds here. This isn't horrible, so we're going to do this one. Um, and his heroes aren't max. And uh, let's see. Is that a single Inferno over there? Uh, we might. Uh, okay. Uh, let's come in from the side then. And I've changed my army up. I used to use 16 wizards. Now I've got three witches in there. It may change back because my uh, wizards are almost level seven try and get an outer wall break here put the witches out heroes throw down a bunch of stuff so i can get in there throw those down i like to put the heel down in the entry area so things don't get totally blasted by the eagle Go ahead and use the ability. Hopefully some troops are going to go into the core. And it looks like they might. Um, okay. Definitely want to save that for this sucker right there. And I may even be able to save my heroes a little on this. Um, they don't look like they're in too much of a danger zone. Let's see if I can knock that out that way. Um, most of the loot is gone. I'm going to go ahead and end this. You see I got most of the loot. The loot bonus. Um, so now if we look. I actually don't have too long. They'll be ready to go for the next raid. And I'll do a request. So this is kind of the farming double up. For Town Hall 11. Uh, lower Town Halls, it's not as much of a concern. Even like on my Town Hall 9 right now, I'm not concerned if I have heroes or not when I'm farming. So, you know, I just use both armies. If I have heroes, great. If I don't, no big deal. But I could see like Town Hall 10 and especially Town Hall 11, this being an issue. So I thought I'd share what I was doing. Have a good day.